For those who import their videos from their iPhone or camera to their computer and edit there, you might find a need to know how to trim your video clips. Sometimes, after filming something, you may need to trim the beginning or the end that you'd rather not keep, or you just want to keep the middle or the highlight of the clip. In this case, all you have to do is trim the ends. On macOS, you have two options. Neither need you to download any special top quality pro level software. If you import your videos into photos, you can use that. If your video is saved in Finder or macOS's file manager, you can use QuickTime Player. Both ways are super simple and the each steps are to follow. For these tutorials, I'm going to use the super long time lapse video from my GoPro of the solar eclipse in 2017. Taken in the line of totality in Newberry, South Carolina, I would like to trim it down to 30 seconds just to get the highlight of the eclipse. The first way I'm going to show you is in Photos, the free app that's built into macOS that lets you organize all of your imported videos and photos in an organized library. Photos can be found, if not on your dock, which is the default location, can be found in your Mac's application folder. To trim the video, navigate to it and open it in Photos. Then, click the gear icon next to the playback controls, and in the menu that appears, click Trim. When trimming using the timeline that appears at the bottom of the video, drag the edges of the yellow wrap in the left to trim the beginning and the right to trim the end. Only the parts of the video clip that are wrapped in yellow will be saved in the final clip. Once you have completed your edit, click trim on the right side of the timeline and your newly edited video clip will be saved to your photo library. Another way to trim a video is to use QuickTime, which is a default video player for videos stored in Finder or Mac OS's file manager. Just like photos, it can be found in the applications folder on your Mac if you want to open it manly, manually. If not, it is a default video player on your Mac. So you could just open the file and it should open with QuickTime unless you have changed it. Once you open the video, you need to access the trim controls. To do so, Click on the edit menu, then go down to trim, or you can use a command, command T on your keyboard. Now that you have the trim controls open, you can see that it looks exactly the same as it did in photos. That's because it works the same too. So just as a recap, to edit a video when trimming, using the timeline that appears at the bottom of the video, drag the edges of the yellow wrap to the left in to trim the beginning and the right end to trim the end. And once again, only the parts of the clip that are wrapped in yellow will be included in the final saved clip. Once you have completed your edit, click trim on the right side of the timeline and then it will ask you to save the video. So give it a name and a place, then click save. If you have enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up and subscribe. If you didn't, click the thumbs down to let me know. If you still have any questions, comments, or concerns, talk to me in the comments below. Also follow Apple Guide on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook at Apple Guide Web to stay up to date with all things happening at Apple Guide. You can find more on our website at appleguideweb.com.